Good morning. Today is Friday, January the 22nd, 2016. I am in Taja, and I am in Miss Julian's third grade class. I am Isaiah Rispin, and I am Miss Julian's third grade class. We have collegiate planning today. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the pleasure for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Let us now stay the school place. Today I will make a choice to have a good day. I will strive to be the best that I can be. I respect all of those fellow students and myself. I account for my words and my actions. It is my responsibility to learn something new. I enter to learn and a partner, sir. I'm a proud Kimberly Stinger. Let us now say the no place for hate promise. I promise, I promise to, to do my best to treat everyone fairly. I promise to do my best to be kind to everyone, even if they're not like me. If I see someone being hurt or bullied, I will tell a teacher. Everyone should be able to feel safe and happy in school. I want my school to be no place for hate. Please pause for quiet reflection. Thank you. You may be seated. The L.O. Kimberly character word is citizenship. An acronym for citizenship, citizenship is separated. Your choices for lunch today are Italian herb chicken, grilled cheese sandwich, broccoli rice, saute green beans, sliced pears. And now for a few words of wisdom. Good morning, Kimberly Elementary School. This is Mrs. Saunders with a few words of wisdom. Take a moment to remember the last time you worked hard to do something. Maybe you worked hard on a writing assignment and received a good grade. Maybe you worked hard to save money for something special, or maybe you worked hard cleaning your room. When you work hard at something and then see the results, all the hard work seems worth it. You feel good about yourself. Booker T. Washington, one of America's greatest teachers, believed strongly in the power of education and hard work. Here's what he says to us today. Nothing ever comes to one that is worth having except as a result of hard work. Today, work a little harder and move closer to what you want, then see if you feel better about yourself at the end of the day. With something to think about, this is Mrs. Saunders. Make it a great day or not, the choice is yours. Our spelling bee is coming soon. Be on the lookout for the spelling list. Perfect attendance is so cool, so you'd better come to school. If you come to school each and every day, you will get to choose a prize from our treasure, treasure chest so you can enjoy and play. All students who come to school every day from now until February the 12th will dig will get to dig in the treasure box for a surprise. Perfect, Perfect attendance, attendance is so cool, so, so you better, better come, come to school. school. Our January books of the month are here. Grades K through 1 are reading Splat the Cat, Blow Snow Blow. Grades 2 and 3 are reading New Year's Eve Thieves. Each book costs $1. See you in the media center. Good morning, Kimberly Panthers. I am Jamicia Patterson, and this is Shania Williams. We are members of the L.O. Kimberly K Kids, and we have a special announcement. K Kids are starting a coat drive, and it is called Caring with Coats. The drive starts today, and the deadline is January 29th. Any size will be accepted. All coats should be gently used with clean with no tears. The box for the coats will be located next to Miss Harkless Brown's office. Please help us care for others who do not have coats in our school. Thank you for listening. Have a great day. The Student Wellness Ambassador wants you to know that it is National Eye Care Month. Do you know that healthy eyes and vision are quite a critical part of the kids' development. 
Also, that to maintain proper eyesight, a nutritious and balanced diet is essential. Here are our top AR readers for the week. In Miss Rivers' class, James, Jacob, Kylie, Jeterius, Mariah, Chloe, Joseph, Ariana, Shamar, Christiana, Davion, and Mariah. In Miss White's class, Haroon. In Miss Spears' class, Stacy, Demarion, Anaya, Yashua, and Damarion. In Miss Cooper's class, Jante, Nasir, Trevor, Amaya, Jacoby, Sherman, Fahim, Chantrice, Abigail, Jaden, Danasia, Miles, Taylor, Jamante, Asia, and Kelly. In Miss Kersher's class, Anthony, Trenard, Chevelle, Camion, Michelle, Imani, and Azaria. In Miss Baker's class, London, Chase, Destiny, Jaden, Nyla, Cameron, Cortavius, Jemiah, Kindred, Asia, Messiah, and Deontay. In Miss Breton's class, Madison, Nakia, Mariah, and Michaela. In Dr. Mosley's class, Layla, Christian, Cameron, Lauren, Jalen, Kivion, Amethyst, Jalea, Abu, Keontae, Mario, Janira, and Tony. In Miss Julian's class, these students have passed at least one AR test and have an average of over 80%. Elijah, Demetria, Marquez, and Yerman. In Dr. Douglas's class, Ahmad, Naviance, and Kenneth. In Miss Wingate's class, Jashan, Nishanita, Amish, Joseph, Dallas, Kemaya, Amari, Angel, Andriana, Oscar, Janisha, Jesus, Jalen, Rakaila, Delicia, and Emmanuel. In Miss Erskine's class, Tong, Micah, Jaleel, Tierra, Davion, and Caleb. In Miss Causey's class, Kennedy, Caleb, Aaliyah, Caden, Destiny, Taruko, Deandrea, Keon, Tatiana, Malik, Trinity, Lyric, Tavares, Solomon, and Quintavious. In Miss Cameron's class, Sanchez, Jaleer, Bolo, Alicia, Nakila, Isabella, Perez, and Amy. In Mr. Hibbert's class, Alahusani, Quintavious, Jaden, Atavius, Carl, Yancey, William, and Cedriana. In Miss Durham's class, Jamicia and Chance. In Mrs. Arnold's class, Elijah, Benjamin, Demetrius, Jacob, Taharka, Deontay, and Jason. In Mr. Wright's class, Christian, Jalen, Joshua, Michaela, Algernon, Yakim, and Quasar. In Miss Smith's class, Jeremiah, Samuel, and Roderick. Happy birthday to our Cuban students who are celebrating their birthday today and this weekend. Happy birthday, Joy! Be sure to stop at the May office to get a birthday pencil from Mr. Stanley. Happy birthday! Have a fabulous Friday at L.O. Kimberly Elementary School. And remember, be respectful, be responsible.